It's only about 20 feet from your house. Right, yep. Sue Travers says this past hot summer was difficult for her family because she's forced to live next to an abandoned trailer full of rotting garbage, trash, and animal feces. It was like living next to a big litter box with a stench. The trailer's owner, Angela White, allegedly abandoned the trailer in June and hasn't been heard from since. A couple of months ago, when the door blew open, Travers took these cell phone pictures of the mess inside. CNY Central photographer Brian Erb was also able to get these images through a window. Travers says the place is littered with cat and dog feces. She says the stench is so bad it has affected her family's health. I also have four kids under four years old and I have a daughter that now has asthma and her doctor said it's a health hazard and I also have asthma now. One neighbor says that vandals have come in here late at night and taken away a lot of scrap metal, which makes this even more of a hazard. The Onondaga County Health Department placed a notice on the front door warning Angela White that because of the offensive odors, she was in violation of the sanitary code. But Travers says the health department did not follow through and condemn the property. That would have allowed Casual Estates to demolish the place. Failing that, the manager at Casual Estates complained to the Town of Clay's zoning enforcement officer who has now decided to condemn the trailer. I'm happy that they stood up and took care of it. It should have been the health department, but mm -hmm. you got to go through who, who you have to go through, and finally the town took care of it. Contacted by phone late this afternoon, the health department's director of environmental health, Kevin Zimmerman, told me that his jurisdiction is limited to an imminent public health threat, and while it is a nuisance, he says odors are not considered imminent health threats unless a chemical is involved. Zimmerman says the county is trying to work with the park to get this finally abated. Casual Estates has withheld comment, but has confirmed that once Clay officially condemns the property, it will bring in a demolition crew. Jim Kenyon reporting.